హలో స్టూడెంట్స్ వెల్కమ్ టు అవర్ ఛానల్ కేఎస్ఎస్ గురుకు టుడే వీల్ డిస్కస్ ద టాపిక్ ఆఫ్ మ్యాథ్స్ లీస్ట్ కామన్ మల్టిపుల్ ఆర్ ఎల్సిఎన్ ఈ ఫర్ దట్ ఇఫ్ యూ హెవ్ నాట్ ఎట్ సబ్స్క్రైబ్ టు అవర్ ఛానల్ ప్లీజ్ సబ్స్క్రైబ్ అవర్ ఛానల్ అండ్ ప్రెస్ ద బెల్ ఐకన్ టు గెట్ న్యూ వీడియో అప్డేట్స్ ఇట్ ఈస్ అదర్వైజ్ నాన్ ఎస్ లాస్ట్ కామన్ మల్టిపుల్ ఆర్ స్మాలెస్ట్ కామన్ మల్టిపుల్ LCM is the lowest or least number which is divisible by two or more given numbers evenly or exactly that is with remainder zero for example let's assume the given numbers are 6 and 8 now the multiples of 6 are 6 12 18 24 30 36 42 60, 66, 72, 84, 90, 96, 102. And the multiples of 8 are 8, 16, 24, 32, 40, 48, 56, 64, 72, 80, 88, 96, 104, 112, and 120. Comparing these multiples, we can find the common multiples of 6 and 8 are 24, 48, 72, and 96. 24 being the least, thus the LCM of number 6 and 8 is 24. Methods of Calculating LCM There are two methods for calculating LCM. They are division method and factorization method. Now come to the first method that is division method. In this method first we divide the given numbers with the least prime number which can divide at least one of them. In the next step the quotients and the indivisible numbers are carried forward and they are divided with the next prime number. This process is repeated till we find no number to divide except 1. Now the product of divisors is the LCM. For example, 16, 18, 40 are the given numbers. Now the calculation is like this. First, 16, 18 and 40 are divided by the least prime number 2. Now the quotients that is 8, 9 and 20 are divided by 2 again. Now the quotients that is 4, 10 and the indivisible number that is 9 are carried forward. Then again they are divided by 2 as it can divide at least one of them. Next in the same process they are divided by 5 and 9 in sequence and now we find no number to divide except 1. Thus, the LCM is the product of divisors that is 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 into 5 into 9 equal to 720. Illustration 2. Let's calculate the LCM of numbers 5, 20, 35 and 40. The process is same as above. They are divided by 2, 5 and 7 in sequence. Now the LCM is the product of divisors 2 into 2 into 2 into 5 into 7 equal to 280. Next is factorization method. It is also known as prime factorization method. Let's assume the given numbers are 20, 18 and 25. First we have to find the fa prime factors of 20, 18 and 25. 20 equal to 2 into 2 into 5. 18 equal to 2 into 3 into 3. 25 equal to 5 into 5. Now we can find prime factor having the highest power that is the maximum number of counting of all the prime factors in any of the given numbers. The prime factor 2 appears 2 times in the prime factorization of 20. Likewise, 3 appears 2 times in prime factorization of 18. And 5 appears 2 times in prime factorization of 25. 
then all the prime factors should be multiplied and maximum time they are counted in any of the given number thus the lcm of 20 18 and 25 each 2 into 2 into 3 into 3 into 5 into 5 equal to 900 however the lcm of two or more prime numbers is always the multiple of them let's understand from an example multiples of 5 are 5 10 15 20 25 30 35 40 45 50 etc and that of 17 are 17 34 51 68 85 102 etc in this case as there is no common multiple lcm is the multiple of the given numbers that is 5 into 17 equal to 85 also the lcm of two or more prime prime numbers is always the multiple of them for example 7 11 and 15 are co prime numbers to remind you co prime numbers are those which have no common factor except one now multiples of 7 are 7 14 21 28 35 etc of 11 are 11 22 33 44 55 55 etc and that of 15 are 15 30 45 60 75 55 etc here there is no common multiple of them so lcm is the multiple of the given numbers that is 7 into 11 into 15 equal to 1155 for two or more given numbers where the larger number is the multiple of the smaller one the larger number is the lcm of them for example lcm of 4 and 8 is 8 as here 8 is the multiple of 4 in another example lcm of 7 14 and 28 is 28 as here 28 is the multiple of 7 and 14 now let's summarize the characteristic point about lcm the lcm of two or more given numbers is always greater than the greatest number among them the lcm of two or more given prime numbers is always the multiple of them lcm of two or more coprime numbers is always the multiple of them for two or more given numbers where the larger number is the multiple of the smaller one the larger number is the lcm of them this was all about this topic feel free to subscribe like share and comment your valuable views thank you for watching